Morning, guys. Live today, Parabuccini's Italian Bistro Chef Frank, our good buddy here today. A tribute to the Sopranos. Tony Soprano. We're paying homage. That's right. Great Italian American, James Galdafini. Caught by his ring. Much like you. Much like you. Not too bad, right? All right. That's coming up next. Rigatoni and broccoli. Hang on. Sopranos was more than just a television show. It was a pop culture phenomenon led by the emotional mob boss played by the late James Gandolfini. Yeah, so sad about his passing. This morning, Craig Coffey joined Chef Franco with a tribute to the show's Italian heritage through food and a little fun. Good morning, gentlemen. Kimberly and Justin, good morning. That's right. We're back. Yeah. yeah. Our own, our own uh, uh, head of the family. Yeah, Franco. Chef Franco here at Parabuccini's. Italian Bistro, thank you so much. You know, we've been gone a long time, yeah, you and I, yeah. and uh, a lot of people have said they miss us. We're fun. You're, they say, gorgeous, yeah. um, you know, very uh, engaging, yeah, and, and those are just the guys. Yeah, and, and, and the I, women. I bring out the best in you. <laughs> I have a lot to say, you too. Know, I, I, you know, I don't know. Man. All right, yeah. today now we're getting started now. It's all about the Sopranos, Tony Soprano. We're playing a little homage to our buddy, James Jimmy. Gandolfini. Jimmy, so we're going yeah. to make some rigatoni and broccoli. Now, these recipes are out of this Sopranos cookbook, but, you know, they're classic Italian-American recipes. They're easy, kind yeah. of, you know. A little garlic, a little sliced garlic. You want cloves of garlic in there. Saute that up around there. So, you know. Do you need the book? Yeah, go ahead. You, open you, the know, page, you, you know what you're doing? Buddy, I invented <laughs> these things. Forget about the book. It's all for television. Okay. This is real life right here, not yeah, television. By the way, this is the same stuff they had on the show, too. And you can find these recipes, not just here at the cookbook, but uh, Franco's touch up on these recipes yeah. at our website at fox21news.com. Some blanched broccoli. Look, you want to keep it green, and you want to just blanch it real quick and then shock it. And then what, is, get of, what does blanch mean? Well, you put it in boiling water, and you cook it till it's tender, and then you just, okay. boom, take it out. A little olive, this is olive oil sauce, so don't be afraid to use the olive oil, okay? Okay. A little salt, a little pepper, a little crushed red pepper if you like it spicy like I do. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. A little rigatone. Now we're talking. Yeah, and rigatone, I, again, that's just the type of pasta, right? Yeah, that's right? the type of pasta, yeah. Yeah, okay. Not as dumb as you look. Look at that, okay. Rigatone. No, I like... Uh, Riga Franco. I like to put, you know, oh. I like to put sausage in there. Yo, broccoli and sausage. Well, where's the sausage? Well, forget about it. I gotta, we got to stay true to the book today. Oh, okay. We're doing everything by the book. All right, this all right, is our rigatoni and broccoli. You get all these we're recipes. Put it in a dish. Easy for your family quit, online. Listen, listen, stop now. Fox21news.com. Quit, inter quit interrupting here for a minute here. Let me finish this up here. Our tribute to uh, Tony Soprano, Riga James Tony with broccoli, a little Parmesan oh, cheese. Perfect. Come on, come on. Boom. In that. Forget about it. Hey, All right, on the way, steak. Pizzaiola, the pizza, pizzaiola. The pizza maker sauce. Very cool, a little steak, right? Yeah, a little meat. Bad. Not too bad. Very cool. That's coming up next. Hang on, back to you guys in studio. I All love right. it. I, I'm it's smelling good already, and not just because of your guys' musk. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. It's him. Yeah. It's him. It must be. It's it's it must be fantastic. He, he puts it on a little thing. <laughs> <Spanish. thick. laughs> is that patchouli oil he's got on? I don't know. Woo! Morning, guys. Live today at Parabuccini's Italian Bistro. Chef Franco on the way. Our tribute today to James Gandolfini, The Sopranos, Italian style. On the way, steaks. Pizzaiola. Pizzaiola. All right. It's coming up next. Fresh meat. Hang on. Well, fans of the HBO series The Sopranos were, of course, saddened by the sudden loss of its leading actor, James Gandolfini. Yeah, in fact, flags are going to be flying at half-staff today <laughs> in New Jersey, mm. and they're going to do the funeral in New York on Thursday. So this morning, the legend lives on with two guys, two dudes, <laughs> Chef Franco, it's <laughs> Craig Coffey, Pervicini's. What's going on, we're gentlemen? Working, we cooking? What are we doing? What are guys? Yeah, he's a legend right here. You're the oh, legend. Yeah. <laughs> come on, man. Right. This is, come on, this is Tony Soprano, right? Yeah, yeah. He is Italian. Colorado. Yeah. That's right, that's yeah. right. Yeah. yeah, all right. I'm known in all five boroughs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're doing our tribute today to uh, James Gandolfini, Tony Soprano here. Right. right out of the Sopranos cookbook. They love to eat, didn't they? Oh, yeah, stick me. Look, me and my wife watching the Sopranos last night. Yeah. I, I had to get up and make some ziti. I mean, because you're watching all the food on the thing, you're starting to salvage. That's right. I look at her, see you hungry, she goes, go start We make some macaroni, you know, <laughs> like two in the morning. I've got to come over here and see okay. you. Now right, we're doing so steak, we saute pizzaiola. Pizzaiola, pizza maker sauce. We saute the, the steak nice, get it caramelized brown. Yeah, real Take good. it off, put it in a different pan, a little salt and pepper, let it sit, okay? Then we're going to add a little garlic to the oil that you cooked the steak in. Ooh. 
Okay. Then we're going to add some fresh tomatoes. Well, not canned tomatoes, like to make the sauce, okay? Okay. And then you're going to saute that up a little bit, right? So the key is a lot of garlic. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you what pizzaiola means. Pizzaiola is a pizza maker sauce. And the only time you ever use oregano is in pizza sauce. So you're going to put a little dried oregano in. Really? Okay. Yeah. You now, know, why is that? Come on, because it's got a different kind of flavor. It's got okay. a pizza flavor. When I teach you how to make marinara, look, at nine years we've been doing this. Did you ever see me put oregano in our tomato sauce? I put oregano Never. in everything. Like, well, because you're one of those guys that think because it ends in a vowel, it belongs in the sauce. <laughs> Forget about it. I put on my cereal. <laughs> all right, so we got the, so we got a little crushed red pepper if you like yeah. it spicy. All right. I'm trying to stay in the splat-free okay. zone back here. The what? The splatter-free oh, zone. Oh, the splatter-free zone. Yeah. That's, yeah, come on. <laughs> so who's your favorite character, Vito Spetafor? I know you like that. I know, I know you were a Vito Spetafor fan. Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh, yeah. No, I, I, I love Sopranos. Oh, I love that show. I mean, it was a great show. Classic I mean, show. He was a great Italian-American actor. And he put the steak back in there. You let it okay. simmer simmer up nice, nice. I mean, you know, that guy, that was a great show. Yeah. I mean, it, it really was. It was By the way, was good. all the recipes online today at fox21news.com. We started right here with uh, rigatoni and broccoli. All this again, right out of the Sopranos cookbook, but a uh, little touch of a. Uh, oh of yeah, we gotta make it. We gotta make too. it. You know, okay. it's easy like we do. Okay, put the steak on a plate, right? We're gonna wrap here. this up, Frank. Okay, here we go again with the wrap it up. Huh? Put that you, on you know, there. Listen, the only oh, person that I got. Oh, now we're talking. You put the tomato sauce, the steak, little Parmesan cheese. Okay. Up next. Uh, steak pizza, all the pizza style. Baked ziti. Oh. <laughs> Let's lost that one right there. Baked ziti, the favorite funeral food. All right. <laughs> That's coming up next, guys. Back to you. Oh, good. I, will you please sauce? bring some back, Craig? Yes. We're, we're doing pictures today. I would like to have something for my pictures. Oh, okay, for sure. You don't get too bloated, though, right? <laughs> no, 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 no. Just, a, just some sauce. I need some marinara don't and some meatballs. Wear a bib, please. Yeah. Okay. 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 All right. Thank you, gentlemen.